Hello, this is David Papkin with TSI Consulting Services. Welcome back to Upgrading Your Skills to Windows Server 2016. In this demo, we're talking about implementing service accounts and integrating with Azure AD. So on London DC1, at the PowerShell window, I'm going to do is add a KDS root key. Then I'm going to uh, use PowerShell to create a new AD service account. Let's try this command here. New AD service account. Name web service. So now I do is this, new AD service account here, get AD service account, and I confirm that I've created it. Okay, great. Now the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to configure the web application service pool to use a group managed service account. So now I'm going to do is go into IIS. And I'm going to go into application pools. And I'm going to go into advanced settings here. Identity. Custom account. I'm going to go set. And I'm going to do is pick a datum. Web service. And so three times that I didn't type in any password. And I'm going to stop the application pool. Stopping the application pool, and then I'm going to restart it. Now, the identity of this one here, just to notice, it's set to web service dollar sign on this. Great. 